ship you Take are in and make plans for the royal majesties of the Middle Kingdom, Sala, Ivan, and Salixa Catalina. Their majesties invite into their presence their excellencies, Ned Spears, Leopard, and Aislinn, and the assembled baronies of the kingdom. Here opens the court of their majesties, Ivan and Catalina, and the 25th day of March, Anno Society, 59, the barony of Red Spears, the occasion of the Kingdom Arts and Sciences Fair. Their Majesties invite into their presence Mistress Rolana and Magister Emily. So today was the Arts and Sciences Fair. Uh, it is not generally well known, but this year we had a really great turnout. Uh, we have 25 entries with three divisionals. A divisional is where somebody, one person, has put three <coughs> items or more, we have one before it, for the day. So uh, they spent three hours or more of their time explaining and describing the piece that they've done. Um, we had a great time. And uh, we have, we wanted to announce the uh, winners, the top three scores, as well as the top divisional score average is the Kingdom a &S Fair champion. Okay? Um, I want to, I'm going to call names up, you don't have to come up. Um, Eleanor Midtime, if you could just stand. <laughs> Eleanor Midtime was our third highest scorer on average today on 25 people. <laughs>
the skills born and developed here in the mid-realm, and we should all be proud of each other as we are of you. Thank you. Their Majesties, call forward any landed barons who need to swear fealty at this time. Thank you, sir. <laughs> And it's not like it's just Sarah. This we here shall never forget. Filter reward given. Their Majesties call into their presence all members of the Order of the Laurel who wish to swear fealty at this time. <coughs> Thank you. 
that Catherine of Diva is worthy of elevation into our order of the pelican. Aye! Catherine, it is the opinion of these, your peers, that you have shown the greater qualities of courtesy, noblesse, and service to this, our kingdom, that the token a member of our most noble order of the pelican. Therefore, we charge you to stand your vigil Think well on your deeds and heart and present yourself before our court at a time to be determined where you will be offered elevation into our order of the pelican. Order, Catherine, you have our leave to go. Thank you. Thank you. Right there, your majesty. For Catherine of Diva, huzzah! Huzzah! Your Majesties request you to their presence, Lady Liotta. The kingdom stands or falls by its accomplishments. The middle kingdom stands to the lords of summer by force of arms, by the strength of its army. Yet these armies stand uninspired without the guards of the kingdom. And our champions stand by us in court. as well. You shall be as the very foundation upon which our armies and all of the people of our kingdom stand. God is to you wish to accept this honor. You should take the oath of your office. to their presence, Mistress Elizabeth Ellis. Good evening. I am Dean of the Federal Cage School. For those of you who are not familiar, the Cage School is an opportunity for our youth to explore the SCA and discover their place in it 
as they grow into adults. And one of the honors of my position is that I get to, from time to time, move pages from one level to the next. And so that is what we are going to do today. I have two pages. I don't know what to tell you about them because they've done everything. They've cooked. They have done gaming. They tried youth combat, youth rapier, grown weapons, archery. They've packed things up. They've cleaned. They've worked in kitchens. And they've done photography. They might be slightly competitive because they are siblings. <laughs> and they will be receiving scrolls of achievement for moving. Their Majesties invite Haley von Leer and Jonathan von Leer into their court. So Haley is moving from Explorer to Learner page and has more than fulfilled requirements. And Jonathan is moving from journeyman to intermediate page and has more than fulfilled the requirements. For Haley and Jonathan Van Gleer, huzzah! request Mistress Audette join them in their court. Two years ago, I took the oath as the Minister of Arts and Sciences for this great kingdom. <coughs> it being two years since then, my term is up, and it's time for me to retire and move on to other projects. I thank you for the trust. I thank you all for the trust. It's been a great two years. Thank you. I have found a replacement. Their Majesties invited to their presence, Signor Tommaso. Master Tommaso generously committed his time in the next two years overseeing the arts and sciences of this kingdom. We ask that you give him your support and participation. Thank you, Mr. Sodden, for your generous service of the past two years. We look forward to your <laughs> For Mr. Sodden, huzzah! Huzzah! Senor Tommaso, Hassan! <laughs> their Majesties request Aster of Shattered Stars join them in their court. Or someone to accept. See, hear, and know that we, Ivan, Tsar of the Middle Kingdom, and Catalina Arsarisa are minded to make unto Aster of Shattered Stars an award of arms in recognition of their service to the Middle Kingdom for their exceptional help in Midram Royal Court with Setup and Teardown. They continue to help their barony 
lending and helping hand wherever needed. We bestow upon them the right to bear arms as registered within the society, not let our hindrance, etc. <laughs> done by our hands this 25th day of May, Anna Societatis 59, while sitting in our canton of, March of marches at Kingdom ANS. Calligraphy and illumination by Marilyn of the Room. For Arbiter Esther, huzzah! huzzah! Their Majesties request Peter of Cleflands join them in their court. Be it known that we, Ivan, King of the Middle Kingdom, and Catalina, our Queen, are minded to make unto Peter of Flecklands an award of arms for his enthusiastic approach to learning and improving his skills. Done this 25th day of May, Anna Societatis 59, in the canton of the March of the Marshes. Calligraphy by Ragnar Storia Ulfrestadter, designed by Ellen de Lacy of Meridian. For Peter of Cleflin, newest book of the Middle Kingdom. Huzzah! <laughs> their Majesties invite into their presence Adrian Harper and Cygnus Destell, or someone to accept. May all who hear these words of Ivan, King by Right of Arms, and Catalina, Queen of Storm and Fire, hear and know that our subject, Adrian Harper, has caught our attentions. He has put forth great effort in the recruitment of newcomers, going so far as to host gatherings at his home and devote time to teach new members on the fencing list. It is for this and the hope that he continues these pursuits that we grant unto him an award of arms with all rights and responsibilities therein. Illumination by Veritas Catriona, a human play, Verity Brando. Let it be known that we, Catalina and Ivan, joint righteous rulers of the Midrealm, are pleased this day to recognize the skill and service of Cygnus Destel. We especially note his skill on the rapier list and his dedicated service to Rivier Constel, and are pleased to award him arms. Illuminated by Brigand of Red Spears, calligraphy by Tan Rodham. For Lords Adrian and Cygnus, huzzah! huzzah! Their Majesties invite me to their court, Mava Sven's daughter. Yeah, so this young lady, second gen in the society, she's been around since birth. <laughs> she's done lots of things, but recently. She has started to help train and arm people in not one barity, but two. When she was in college or when she was at home. For that, we would do this. Proclaim throughout our realm that we, Ivan, King by right of arms of the Middle Kingdom, and Catalina, our Queen, do recognize the service that Mela, Spendutter, hath given unto our kingdom for her contributions in helping outfit and train new fighters for our dragon army. We do here publicly commend her and are pleased to bestow upon her the award of the Purple Fret.
their majesties invite into their presence Elise of Onwit. <laughs> wow! Of the Cronison's Guild 
elevating the societal image of partisans as women of education and power with her historical research, would now recognize her as a companion of our Order of the Willow. Scroll by Seidel of Brittany. Tsaritsa Catalina, Queen of Craft and Knowledge, and Ivan, King by Right of Arms. We have heard of the undertakings of our subject, Ulfgaard Rolfsson, and are well pleased for his constant work with wood and metal, especially with blacksmithing and knife making, we grant unto him entry into our Order of the Willow. Illumination by Lady Kusafen, Craig, calligraphy by Sergeant Andreas Renardi. For Lord Ufgar, huzzah! Their Majesties invited to their presence, Maeve Ramsey. If you don't know, and you may not, this definitely should. Because you have seen her art constantly and forever and all the time. Because May has been doing scrolls for this kingdom for years. And her art is not only beautiful, she is generous with it. And for that, we would do this today. We, Ivan, saw by right of arms of the Middle Kingdom, and Catalina and Tsaritsa give greetings. Know ye that may have most freely given unto the Middle Kingdom their time and love by scroll making, and we are minded to make them a companion of our noble order of the Dragon's Heart. Yeah! We want to thank our cousins for coming out, supporting ourselves, Rapsties, the populace, and to the populace of the Middle Kingdom. Thank you for joining us. It's going to be a wonderful time. I unfortunately was not able to hear most of the day, but I am told that the AMS was amazing today. There were many great classes that took place. <laughs> unfortunately, my name was not here today, but 
Thank you. 